At an auditorium in Sudan's capital Khartoum, members of an orchestra and choir are getting ready to perform. Many here participated in the mass movement that eventually ousted longtime leader Omar al-Bashir. More recently, Sudan's witnessed a military coup and dramatically deteriorating economic conditions. For performers like Rania Magub, music is a way to overcome pain and spread cheer. Despite the deteriorating economic conditions in Sudan, as well as the families who lost loved ones, despite those injured and the grim reality we are in, we are still able to make people happy, to give even a small bit of hope through art, to deliver our message and make people listen to us. At the end, art is a message. Nearly 95 protesters have died since an October 25th military coup, according to medics aligned with the protest movement. That has caused a devastating toll on the morale of many young Sudanese activists. Nevertheless, many continue to engage in artistic activities. At a primary school in the capital, Rasan Balula is working on a mural. The school was a spot where women street sellers were detained during security raids under Omar al-Bashir. We as resistance committees managed to make the place a tool for resistance. We brought it back as a school. He says the school will serve as a reminder for future generations.